everyone, it's Coach Rick, and today's on. Oops, it's upside down. Today's unboxing is on Garden of Life Raw 400 billion probiotic. I got this in the refrigerated section of the uh, Fruitful Yield in Bloomingdale, and I don't usually touch this one because it's too expensive. It's like 40 bucks just for five days. Five days, 40 bucks. But you're not supposed to take it. At least the uh, the intention I would say is don't take all month long this thing it'll be very expensive I, I do think the high-end probiotics are going to cost you but i'm practical and i think you can go back to saccharomyces or other affordable probiotic brands um between the pulses of this big guy but the reason i wanted to show this is because i've had some patients recently come in and i'll be posting a video on adam's story and they are reversing disease. And I really think that reversal of disease is with healthy lifestyle, but it's also with taking care of the gut. So the gut is, I just did a video on my YouTube channel and I talked about the uh, GALT system, gut associated lymphoid tissue, virus patches. It's, it's, it's essentially where your immune system is really based. The majority of your immune system is in the small intestine. However, uh, we don't think of the gut as being the focus of immunity. And in fact, there's a lot of emotion and mood that can be turned on through this co-pilot of the immune system here in the gut, digestive system. I call the digestive system the co-pilot and the neurological system or the brain the pilot, but they work in concert. If you just take your brain and say, ah, I'll just take an antidepressant and do nothing with the gut or your food, you're taking care of half the problem. So. Not to stray off too much with regards to my unboxing, but if you can control the immune system, if you can control the gut, I think you can control life. So I can't control what comes at you, but you control the way you react to it. So that's why I think this is important. So this is a powder and the powder is, let me open this up. Uh, yeah. So that is a scooper and I'll have to... Um, I don't have any water here, but I'll have to dose this now. I'm on my fourth day of the fasting mimicking diet, and I want to inoculate my gut with this bacteria. If For those of you who don't know, this is the Prolon box, fourth day. And I think by now, uh, I've contracted all the bad cells. I've contracted the digestive system, and stem cells, I assume stem cells, according to Walter Longo's data, are starting to reproduce or at least they're starting to get turned on, on the refeed cycle of the sixth to the 16th day of the fasting mimicking diet, you will have stem cells blossom. And my theory is that if you inoculate your gut during the time that all the contractions occurring of this five day pulse fast, I feel when you start to refeed your gut, and I've done videos on this before, but when you start to refeed your gut on the sixth to the 16th day, not only will you have good cells in your your bacteria in your gut blossom the bad cells hopefully would have died off but you'll also have an army of new guys there to take over and blossom as well so if you have a half if your immune system is based in the digestive tract and you contract the digestive tract with fasting and then you refeed with healthy food you'll expand the digestive system but you'll expand it with a new inoculated bacterial city so that's what my theory is. Uh, if you look at the data on ulcerative colitis, people that have done fecal uh, microbiota transplants, and that's actually putting poop from a healthy person into a very unhealthy person, the data shows that if you do one inoculation, it doesn't really take. The sick person still stays sick with ulcerative colitis, but if you hit with antibiotics, well, if you first hit with antibiotics, and then you transplant the fecal from healthy to diseased, and then you continue hitting with fecal microbiota transplants, the disease is reversed. So I can't, or if you're gonna do this alone, you can't obviously take antibiotics, but I think this idea about not needing antibiotics and trying to reset your gut, your leaky gut with a fast, and then the new inoculum, I think this should work. If you do it a couple of times, it should take. I'm, I'm gonna uh, videotape my journey, but to bring this all back to the beginning, I'm going to take this for the five days and save some money. I'll probably do it again next month, but I'll, I'll record how I do, especially after this fasting mimicking diet. I do these five day pulses every once in a while to shock the system, 
lose weight, uh, gain some weight from COVID, and also turn on the immune system. So there's uh, things that I have done in the past with the five-day fast where I was able to turn on uh, myocytes or stem cells that are muscle, that like I never had it before. So usually if you have stem cells and or a good bacteria, you get them when you're young and that's about all. But if you can turn it on with a diet change and maybe inoculate, I think we can use science to get healthy, turn down the immune system, turn down autoimmunity like Hashimoto's, Crohn's disease, multiple sclerosis, that's my theory, and maybe blossom so you can control the disease and manifest greatness. So my warriors do great. I wanna see if we can kind of use this as a new way to get warriors, more warriors on our team and hopefully have a healthy life. So if you have any comments on how to use this, put them down below. See my other videos. Otherwise, I'll see you at the next.